Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Luis here, Green Zebra Gardening. Today, uh, we're making some tostadas inside, but I need some lettuce, I need some green, so I figured why not just bring you guys along. I'm gonna go ahead and cut some greens, uh, maybe some kale, a few cabbage leaves and whatever I can find. So I'm gonna show you basically from garden to table and everything in here I started from seed, I realized that the other day. Anyway, let's go. Okay. All right. Okay, so we got the bowl. We got the, we got some little clippers. Come on down. Okay. I've got a camera guy today, uh, and uh, I'll show you him at the end. But we're going to come closer. We're gonna clip some lettuce, some arugula, some arugula. Can you grab me the bowl over there? Put together this way. So you got some arugula. We're gonna take only a few from each one. Uh, that way we're not all harvesting everything all at once from one plant and that way it gives it time to recover. We're going to grab a couple of leaves of kale. The kale isn't looking that great, but it still looks pretty good. Oh yeah. Move it up. So you can actually see me better. There okay. we go. All right. We're gonna grab some lettuce over here on the end. Come closer. We're gonna grab a full plant here because this one's overcrowded. With some lettuce? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, we have a couple more leaves off of this one. I haven't harvested in a while. So we need to pick some stuff. This one has like nothing but arugula. So I'm gonna plant. We have nothing but arugula and we have um, calendulas. And so the calendulas, I guess they're edible, but not really in this case. So, oh, come over here. We have some Swiss chard. Ooh. Yeah, these are pretty. These we, are had, we had those. Yeah, see, these are pretty. Oh uh, yeah. So, you see me? Yeah. See my face? Yeah. All right. So, we got some red Swiss chard. We got a couple of white ones. So we're gonna grab a couple of leaves off these big plants. Those look like fancy. They look fancy, because yeah. they're colored? Oh, come here, we got more lettuce over here. We definitely need more lettuce. Yep. Can, I, can, I, make, can I make the lettuce with you? Can you make the lettuce with me? No, baby, the lettuce is already made. We're just harvesting. You can help me take it in. We we'll see that one. That one we don't need because that one's ugly. No. That one's like really messed up. Those ones are great. These are great, exactly. So we need a good amount of lettuce. It's gonna be a bunch of dosadas from the boys and I, and Grandma might get in on that. So I want to make sure we have enough because the last time uh, some of it we ran out, so I had to come out, run out, and literally get more. Because we uh, use too much. You know, it is a mix of a little bit of everything. I've grabbed clippers for these, but because this is lettuce. That's a lot. This is actually not that much. Considering it's a bunch of us eating, it's not going to be all that much. So, show them show them the bowl. Okay. How much we have in the bowl? Yeah. So let's zoom in. Ooh, too much. You see? So that's what we got right now. Um, is there any more? See? Is there any more? Look. We have that entire garden over there that we can pick from. Yeah. All right, hold it right there. Okay. Don't move. Okay. You know what, let's grab a couple of the cabbage leaves, these purple ones. Oh, yeah. Those are pretty, huh? Yeah. Um, can I take just, the bowl? Can you take the bowl? No, just stay right there for right now. Okay. Mm -hmm. We are definitely gonna have to wash these. Yeah, because, because we're going inside and making tostadas. Okay. With the bowl? I think that's with the bowl, yes. Stay with the bowl. Point it up. Alright. I think that's it. Just to show you these. These are just some small pruners. These are really sharp. I'll leave yeah. the link down below as to where they are or where I got them from. This is mainly local for Long Beach. Um, this is from Vita Plant Shop. This is oh. a 
Niwaki. I'll see if I can find it on Amazon as well for those people that are not local to Long Beach. You can order them on her website, but I think she only does like local delivery. Or if you just want to go into the store and pick them up, she has these and she has some bigger prettier ones. I may insert a picture in here somewhere. Anyway, that's pretty much it. So let's show them the bowl. See what we got in there. All right, so we got lettuce, we've got kale, we have shard, we have a mix of stuff. This is all gonna get chopped up, rolled up, and then we're gonna put them on some, on some tostadas. All right, guys, that was a really quick video. I don't know how long it's gonna be. I might do some B-roll where I'm showing chopping up the leaves, washing, it's basically just rinsing and washing. And we have a salad spinner from Ikea. I don't remember how much I paid for, but it's a small one. So we're gonna chop it up, rinse it, cut it, da 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 put it on some tostadas. I might, like I said, I might throw some B-roll in here of us showing that. But that's it for this video. Hope you guys are getting out in the garden. Hopefully you're not freezing too much. Uh, sorry, I live in Southern California, so we got stuff growing year round. Anyway, go ahead and hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit that bell notification, or hit that bell for the notifications. That way when a new video goes up, which at this rate, I think I'm doing one a week. I'm trying. <laughs> I've also got some seeds going. I've already got some stuff that's popped up. I'm gonna link my seed starting video for pea pellets below. It's been up for a few years and it's pretty much still is the same process, although now I'm at a different location. So it's a little different. I may do an updated video to that, but I'll leave that original one there. It's just under 10 minutes. It's got a lot of views in the last few years, especially right now during seed starting time. I've got some peppers already coming up. I, we spent part of the day today trying to find eggplant seeds, but I couldn't find anything locally. Anyway. I'm going to head out. Catch you guys on the next one. Peace.